Yo, what is going on you guys? Reppin' the 407 here bringing you a brand new video. In today's video, we are bringing you another Diamond Dynasty gameplay. Unfortunately, I did record two videos and they both got deleted because I made some mistakes deleting some stuff and I deleted the gameplays before saving them, so I made a mistake. But this is the lineup. I did add uh, Jonathan Lufroy, uh, catcher, and then we have Yelich. I haven't used him technically yet in a gameplay, even though I did use him last game that I didn't record well I did record but I deleted but right now we are also gonna make a couple upgrades Anthony Rizzo is at an 87 right now that is insane and stories at an 86 very nice so those cards are probably going to stay in the lineup for a little bit while this is our bench if you were wondering and then I also showed in the last episode I pulled that uh, the first inning pack and I did get Cy Young so hopefully we can use them I didn't get to use them in the last two uh, game plans I did so maybe this could be his debut if not it'll be somebody else's debut that I'm about to pick up right now but that is the squad and let's go to the packs so I am going to pick someone from the diamond players let's open this one because I did make it to uh, the regular season from those games and we are going to get a starting pitcher it doesn't even matter but the person we are going to pick here and the lineup the order changed but let me find him real quick it is from the Tampa Bay Rays and if you know who are in this pack you should know who I'm about to get and it is right here Evan Longoria his stats right there he has gold hitting and uh, diamond fielding so that is a really nice car he has an 88 overall and since we need a third baseman I'm definitely taking him so add him to the lineup for uh, Eugenio Suarez and we have a third base a diamond third baseman finally so this is the squad or okay there you go it didn't add uh, Longoria for a second so that's the squad we're missing two players to get a complete diamond uh uh, field I guess fielding I guess I don't know how to say it but I am planning to upgrade Trevor story soon I will probably have that in the next video hopefully probably not but I'm hoping to have him in the next video and then uh, Anthony Rizzo I'm not complaining about him I'll probably get a first baseman soon but here you go you see I did uh, lose one game that was a video that was the video I was supposed to uh, post today and then the second game I won and then I made it to the regular season but unfortunately like I said it got deleted so we are four and one and we're just going to jump straight into it and hopefully we walk away with a W and make it five and one all right so here we go this is who I am facing he has a pretty decent squad so it is going to probably be like a little even matchup and I am not using a uh, Cy Young yet so James Paxton will be our starting pitcher and this should be a good game here we go, Christian Yelich up to bat. This is his first time batting in a video. Unfortunately, like I said, the other videos got deleted, but here we go, Yelich has a .400. I think he only has like a total of six at bats, or I don't know, I don't know, but Yelich right there is going to, that's a double, that's at least a double. Yelich, this card, this card's nice. I love this Yelich card so far, and he gets a double right there. I think he has like a total of three doubles at like seven at bats only. Oh, and I swing too early, so that is going to wrap up the top of the first. One, two count right here. Corey Seager up to bat. In the gameplay I was supposed to post today, Corey Seager actually hit a three-run home run for the uh, dude I was facing, and that clutched out the game for him. So that's how I got that one loss, because he started off on a 3-0 run and then hit a three-run home run with Corey Seager to win the game. One, one count right here. Joey Votto up to bat. Let's get a double play. Get a double play. That's what I'm calling. There you go. Double play. Double play. There you go. That wraps up the first inning. Brandon Phillips up to bat, 0-2 count right here. He is our second baseman, but I need to upgrade him because for some reason, I'm not a huge fan of him. Like, I don't like his card, but... That's a strike? He barely... He just... Like, what? Here we go. Jonathan Luproy, our new catcher, up to bat. And right here, we are going to hit it with him, but it's probably going to be an out. So we both haven't been doing anything crazy, so we... I need to change that. Don't let him change that. And right there, straight to first base, and he gets me out. 0-2 count right here. Christian Yelich back up to bat. We cannot strike out. Come on, Yelich. Come on. Oh, and that's a pop out. Bottom of the fourth right here. Ken Griffey Sr. up to bat once again. And is this this probably going to be a hit? Yep, that's a hit for him, but it's only a single. And yeah, Corey Seager up to bat for him once again. 0-1 count. That's a double play right here. Double play. Thank you. Ooh. Okay, Brandon Phillips. He bare hand that ball. I like that. Two outs in the bottom of the fourth. Joey Votto up to bat, and that is gonna be another hit. Yeah, I'm not good. I'm not diving. I wanted to dive, but I'm not risking it. Three-one count right here. Can he swing? He does swing, and that is gonna be another hit. And we're throwing it to second, but Joey Votto makes it safe. He has two men on base. All right, that's an out. Or just throw it at first. I was gonna throw it at second, but just throw it at first. That's three outs. 
One two count right here. Anthony Rizzo up to bat. I can't, I need to stop swinging at stupid stuff because that's what I'm doing right there. That's not stupid, but it is gonna be an out. Two outs in the bottom of the fifth inning. Let's wrap it up right here, and it is gonna wrap up the fifth inning with this, or not, because they don't want to pick up the ball. Chad Green right here. Let's see, can we get him to swing? And he is going to get a base hit with Ken Griffey Sr. right there. Last time Ken Griffey was on base, we got a double play. Can we do it again? We're not going to get a double play, but that is going to be an out, and he's going to stay at first. Joey Votto has 23 speed. I need it. There you go. And he's going to hit it, so I'm throwing it to third. Throw it to third. Okay, so he stays at second. Bottom of the six right here, we have one out, so we need to get a double play on this play. Joey Votto has 23 speed. <laughs> Christian Yelich up to bat. We are down 3-0. Oh, that three-run home run just killed me. But we need to come back. Christian Yelich right there. That's, that's got to be a home run. That's got to be a home run. And Christian Yelich. Let's go. Christian Yelich with the three. Or not the three. Well, with the home run. I wish I got a three-run home run. But Christian Yelich. 0-2 count. Trevor Story at the bat right here. And we are going to swing at a low ball. And can we make it? He has 88 speed. Can we make it? Trevor Story, he makes it. Right? He made it, okay. I've never really made a wild pitch before, but I will take that. Brandon Phillips, oh, Brandon Phillips right through the gap. Let's go, let's go. I'll take it. I, I could have made it all the way home, which makes me mad. I could have made it all the way home with probably Brandon Phillips, but that's a ground rule double, unfortunately. I'm mad that they call that a ground rule double. I know why it's a ground rule double, because it went over the wall, but right here, we're testing it. Come on, Trevor Story. We're testing it. Trevor Story made it home. Okay, I'll take that. And we made the wild pitch. That's the second time I made a wild pitch before, and it's in the same game. Down by one run right here. We have a man at third. Come on. All we need is a hit, Evan Longoria. All we need is a hit, and Evan Longoria, that's all we need. All we need it. Make it to home. That's all we... Okay. No, wait, 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 wait. I forgot he could got out of the double play. Dang it. Bottom of the seventh, he has one out in the game right here, and we are about to make it two outs. Come on, Christian Yelich, catch up, catch up. Christian Yelich made it. Nice catch. Willie Mays is up to bat, 0-2 count, two outs. He's 0-3 for three in the game so far, so we're probably going to get struck it out right here, and we do. 0-2 count, two outs right here. Parker up to bat, and that is going to be an easy out. That wraps up the inning, ninth inning. This is where we have to be clutch. We at least need one run. That's it, one run. 0-2 count, Chris Sell at the uh, mound right there. And can we get a hit? And we are going to get a hit. That's a hit, but that's an out. Yelich up to bat. He's been having a great game. I need you to keep it up. Come on, Yelich, get another home run. Get another home run. And right here, Yelich is not gonna get a home run, but that is going to be a, a single. I will take that, let's go. He's gotten on base almost every time, right? Except once, yeah, every time but once. Trevor Story up to bat right here, and I'm swinging at that, and that's a strikeout by me, and that's gonna wrap up the game. I thought I could have got the steal and I struck out. I just lost the game. So here we go. Here are the stats. Three for four for Yelich. He had a home run and a double. And I just, I got caught stealing to wrap up the game. As you can see, he did hit that three run home run, which just killed me as you can tell, because that's the only time he scored. And that's, that's, that's unfortunate. Let's check out this, uh, our pitchers though. Our pitchers, we only had one strikeout the whole game. He had a total of how many strikeouts? Nine strikeouts the whole game. Not, it's not the best, not the worst, but still kind of bad. Nine strikeouts compared to one. But yeah, we lost the game, unfortunately. All right, boys, so that did wrap up the gameplay. Unfortunately, we did walk away with an L. It was a close game, but that three run home run helped him out so much and I lost the game because of it. Christian Yelich did have a great game in his debut, I guess you could call it, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know down in the comments what you would like to see me do in the next episode. But with that being said, once again, like, comment, subscribe. Like always, I will be posting more videos soon. I hope you guys have a great day. Take care and peace out.